morning. Um, this is an exciting vlog. So this is vlog number 92, I think. Um, Barney, stop crying, I'm trying to vlog. Um, anyway, yes, yeah, so this is an exciting vlog because it is Hindu weekend. So my cousin gets married in, I think, six weeks now. Um, and this weekend is her Hindu, so I've not really been able to talk about it much because she has no idea where she's going um, and just, yeah, we've kept everything a secret from her. But we are off to Crete this weekend. I can tell you, it's really weird as well because I'm telling you this before she's found out, but obviously once this vlog goes live, I mean, the weekend will have been and gone. <laughs> She'll have already been to Crete, so she'll definitely know where she's going. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really excited. It's been a big task, so I'm going to just put you here and chat to you. Yeah, it's been a very tall order, so if anyone has ever booked a Hindu or organised a Hindu, um, oh my god, <laughs> I have a new found respect for Hannah and Nat who did mine last year, because organising uh, started off as 15 women and ended up as 13 women to go abroad has been really really hard work um, and I think as well it's made worse by the fact that obviously I work for myself, I work on my own, I don't work with a team and I've become very used to working just with me I guess so like there's, we've got a team of bridesmaids obviously um, and also my auntie who is Hannah's mum um, and they would be like oh we haven't done this so I'm like oh yeah no I have I just didn't tell anyone <laughs> because I'm so used to doing things just in my own head and forgetting to tell everyone but anyway it's been fine but it's been quite an experience quite a learning curve actually but we've done it I hope I hope by the time you see this, we will have had a fabulous Hindu in Crete and um, I will be browner than I am now and I will be saying, that all went really well, I don't know what I was worried about, but who knows. Um, one other piece of slightly less exciting news, and I have to try and do this without crying. Um, Toby, my middle brother, who doesn't feature on the vlog very much because he is anti-vlogging. <laughs> he gives me such a hard time if I get him on the vlog. But anyway, he's our middle brother. Um, me and my two brothers are super close, as I'm sure a lot of you will have realised. Um, next weekend, the 7th of July, he's going to live in America. I don't even know what else to say. He's going to Boston. Um, the minimum is for two years and I'm hoping that that will be it and then he'll come home. Um, he's got an amazing job opportunity out there so I am so excited for him and I'm really like battling with being really excited and really proud of him and really pleased for him and wanting him to have an amazing time and <laughs> being really angry with him for leaving us. Sounds so dramatic but um, Ugh. we've always been a really close family and we we see each other like pretty much every week like if everyone's free on a Sunday and we're all just sitting at home someone will put on the whatsapp should we go for a carvery and then we'll all just meet up at the local carvery or mum will just put on there does anyone want to come around for dinner we'll all just end up around mum so it's gonna be very strange to have one of us missing um, everyone keeps going, oh, it's okay, you can have more holidays. I don't want more holidays, I just want my brother here. <laughs> but failing that, you know, we will be going out to Boston. Um, and it's, yeah, an incredible opportunity for him and I'm so excited. And if it's just two years, then I can deal with that. Toby, if you're watching, it better not be any more. That is it, two years, that's your limit. If you fall in love with a girl out there, then she better be ready to come home to England because you're not living out there. <sighs> so yeah, anyway, so that's next week. Um, Actually, the barbecue that we had last week for Father's Day wasn't for Father's Day. If you watch it back, it says, good luck, Toby, in the background, and there's American flags all over the place. And that's because it was a going away party for Toby. Anyway, so that's that, that's next week. But the reason I just mentioned it in this week is because we've actually known for maybe two or three months but we've not been allowed to say anything because his team that he manages in his office 
didn't know because there had to be certain things put in place until they um, before they could find out um, and they found out yesterday so we're now allowed to tell everyone so yeah this is me telling you and I'm sure next week's vlog is going to be very tearful some people are going to be like oh he's only going for two years I don't know what you're moaning about but trust me for us that is a big deal like we all live within half an hour of each other we have always lived within half an hour of each other um yeah it's a big deal <laughs> but anyway there's nothing I can do about it and I just have to get on with it and I am excited for him but selfishly I really don't want him to go anyway so that leads me on to tonight um this evening it so today is what day is it Thursday and tonight we are going to my mum's to watch the England uh, football game because basically so little Sam will be away when Toby actually leaves for America so this will be our last kind of um, time that we're together as a family before he goes away I should also mention he is coming back in July and then again in August <laughs> so you probably think I'm making a really big deal out of this but it's still a really big thing for us but anyway yeah so this will be our last time um just at like the six of us um before he goes away so we're gonna do that tonight and then I'm gonna go and stay at Hannah's house um because we have a taxi picking us up at three o'clock in the morning go to the airport that time is only reserved for horse shows and holidays so it's a good job we're going to the airport so yeah anyway I'm excited about this vlog let's get going Hello. gotta be on the vlog <laughs> you don't have to be on the vlog he does he's more important than me so tell us your plans Guys, I'm watching football. No, not then now. we're gonna have, I think, chicken and salad. Oh, because it was easy. I'm vlogging, you can't vlog too. No, no we Why is I'm it so vlogging. intrusive? Sorry, sorry. No, anyway. So, you make <laughs> yeah. a shit window, so don't stand there. I, I have nothing really to say to you, but I. This is the only time you're gonna be on my vlog. <laughs> Uh, well, no, when I come to Boston for holidays, then you're going to have to be on the vlog. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cool. When's yeah. that then? Uh, when do you want to come? Um, with you, you on flight? next Saturday? No. no. You can't do that, no. Okay, Sam, I've told Toby that um, I'm going to move in with you guys on Monday, and then he can put a seat by his desk for me, so I can spend all the time with him until Saturday. Okay. Sounds good. I mean, I'm not even at work now. I don't know how much you're... Oh, I'll come with you wherever you're going. Okay. Okay, yeah. Huh? Dentist? Yeah, dentist, yeah. Victorious. <laughs> over there, guys. He's not allowed Dr. Doolittle. Actually allowed up there. She's Billy. Got big dog rules. And the big others have little dog rules. Going so far. What are you doing? Can they? Oh, or this sofa. Hi. <laughs> They're strategizing, Mum. Well, that was rubbish. We lost. <laughs> but apparently it was tactical, so i just put up with it. I always feel like when it's nil-nil, I might as well have just not watched it and someone could have just told me the score. That would have been way more interesting. But anyway, I'm on the way to Hannah's now. So, the Hindu can start. I think we're gonna watch Love Island first because I think it's gonna be good. Are you gonna watch it at home? Probably. Oh, look at you working that sunset. Who's working the sunset? You. I was going to say the Hindu started, but it's not started. This is Jen, by the way. This is Hannah's other bridesmaid, who I don't think you've met. Um, and that's Hannah and Laura. You've definitely met them. Yeah. But we're going to about, about to get some sleep and then get a three o'clock taxi. So, night. So, do you live there, your mum? <laughs> Laura, you cannot do that. I'm reading my boarding card, it's really interesting. Video. Um, yeah. <laughs> Where's Hannah? Oh, oh, I'm reading my boarding card. Oh, super Where's Hannah? Anyway, good morning. We're at the airport. 
Julie's bag for getting searched. Other than that, it's all gone well so far. The plain hungry hippo is on the floor. <laughs> We're on the fly. Oh god, there she is. <laughs> Go. Oh, you've got to take the reception. Oh, yeah. 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 So we've got mothers. Over there. Pretty much everyone on here is a nervous buyer. So, no, 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 no. you're not. You're not, are you? I'm not buying. Good. Cool. Right, I am going to plug myself in and listen to the podcast. This is the itinerary for the week. End. This is the same for the week then. Nice. We wish. Welcome to Iraq. Here is a local So we're at the airport, and this was our last bag, and um, we couldn't see it on the carousel. And then we had to come to this lost and found place and make a report because apparently it was damaged. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, a little scratch. <laughs> Looks like it's been like dropped and is then there's been like What is that? Is that part of the case? It's yes. not some of your yeah. stuff. No, none of my stuff. Is, it hasn't got any of my stuff. We made it! So let me show you the apartment. <laughs> this is our, oh, I was going to say little apartment, but it's not really that little. Come in here. Hot! <laughs> yeah, we, there's a lot of stairs up to here. Yeah, I'm going to put your swimming costume on. This is mine and Hannah's room. I'll show you our view. It's a little balcony. And that is our pool. It's so lovely. I'm gutted we're only here for two days. I'd love a week here. It's beautiful. So we went to get food from Lidl because which was on the way back from the airport because we're there. Spend the night in tonight. We're gonna have like a barbecue and play games by the pool. Yeah, so we went to get food. We've unpacked that. Now I'm gonna put my swimming costume on. You happy, Han? <laughs> Lovely time. <laughs> <laughs>
my balcony. It's so pretty. Oh my god. Isn't it gorgeous? amazing. Right, so it's the evening. We've been sitting by the pool all afternoon. Um, we are ready. Hannah is still getting ready, but we are going to go and decorate the outside of it. There's cooking going on in all the villas. Very exciting. so pleased and then on the pool you can't really see them yet so I'll film them later but we've got little floating candles they're picking limes from the tree to go in the gin and tonics gin and soda water oh well tough get drunk and then you won't know <laughs> I was just thinking that Tracy, vodka and lemonade. No, vodka and orange. What, yeah. what, what time is it? What day is it? That's it. <laughs> so, the bride is reading a card, and if you've done, done what it, it says on the card, you have to drink. Yeah. Might never have I ever. Uh, so drink if you have asked a man out. Sorry? Drink if you've asked a man out. Wow, what a bunch of independent women we are! <laughs> 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 Don't worry, I'll be single. Drink if you have been arrested. Oh, we're a wild bunch of women. Are you drinking for that? Does it count if it was Jack? Right. Who's next? Thumb master, so you can play this at any point in the game. When you put your thumb on the table, oh, everyone must awesome. follow. So it's like the heaven exactly. one. Oh, so, like, so, like yeah, so Jen can use this at any point. She'll put Who her can? thumb on the table. Who can? Who can? Right. You <laughs> see, Jen, Why do you suggest that? No, no. We all have to do it roll. I'm not really like this. It's the best You're welcome. Drink if you have skinny dipped. Three, five. <laughs> <laughs> oh! We don't we made it obvious now. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I think we know who was last. <laughs> I don't know who. I'm pointing! I'm going to make a roll. <laughs> called Piccolo which is on your phone um, and it, you put your, all your names in and, and it gives you instructions it's really really good if you ever have a party or anything so there is also a dirty version we're not playing the dirty version right? oh so you're dangerous drunk mums would appreciate that <laughs> oh hey guys it's chief vlogger here hi my name's Sophie Callahan, and I like to do my vlogs Right, now we're playing a game of cards. What's it? It's just called yeah. These Cards Will Get You Drunk. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, no, that's, that's literally it. It's working. Are you having fun? It's it's really lovely time. Good. Oh, what is that? Is it warm? Wax. No. no. Do you want it? I don't know what's going on. Who's next? 
Caroline. Caroline. Yeah, that was if you. Everyone votes on who is most likely to be in bed by 10 p.m. and that person drinks. You, because you'll get so drunk before. <laughs> She's the only mum still up. Oh, yeah. Trooper. <laughs> but look it. All guys drink that. <laughs> right, that's it. You're getting all night and nominate someone now. Oh, it's my turn. Okay. <laughs> you must either take off an article of clothing or drink. I mean. <laughs> oh, spoils all the fun. I've only got a dress on. <laughs> The person with the biggest ears drinks. What? That'll be me. I'll be that pretty hefty ears. I do as well. That's why I never wear little ears. Oh, you do. Don't I mean, that's not the most accurate one. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 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 <laughs> what a terrible first world problem for you. <laughs> Ask another. Make any action. The next person repeats all previous actions and adds another. Continue until somebody messes up. Oh. oh that sounds hard. Okay. Um, I've already messed up. Oh, okay. Hang on. Oh my god. It's going to be really complicated by the time it gets here. Oh no. I can never do that. I've forgotten it. <laughs> Yeah. 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 <laughs> I can never do that. <laughs> no, that's just... right. <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. Good morning. How idyllic is this? There's some little goats down here. You can hear the sound of their little goats' bells. And then over here, there's a little boy filling up his water bucket, having a little sing song. Oh, I love it. I want to stay here for a week. There he is. Good morning, it is Saturday and I am just going down for a massage. So we have one of the bridesmaids, um, Jen, has, <laughs> you right? Yeah, yeah, I'm going now. Um, has booked a um, therapist to come and give us all massages, which is so lovely. So I'm off for that now. Oh my gosh, that was amazing. I feel so like chilled right now. Did you enjoy your massage? Oh, it was so comfy, yeah, wasn't yeah. it? Apparently I've got a very tight back. <laughs> yeah, I've had some in here. Yeah, same. Oh, it hurts. Yeah, I just told you to get a bit softer. Did you? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to sit back by the pool and spend the afternoon reading my book and sunbathing and having a dip in the pool. How was your massage, ladies? Very nice. It's nice, wasn't it? Okay, yeah. We're playing I dickhead hoopla. We've not got one on the dick so far. Oh, that was on me. There's two here. Oh, How many rings do you get each? And it tries to pop mine up a bit. Yeah. How many rings do you get each? Oh, oh my God. We're just throwing them in our face. We're going to have a race to see who can get one on the quickest. Well, first. Go, go. Don't have your mouth open because if it hits your teeth. Oh, oh my God. It's so raw. <laughs> Oh, wait. 
We are oh ready to go. We're all in pink tonight because that is the colour of Hannah's wedding. So it was it's pink to make the boys wink tonight. Oh, <laughs> and we've got a pink Pardon? Yeah. Yeah. We are on our way. I don't. I was going to say the town, but I don't even know how you say it. Red No rhythm. No. No, it's got not got a cut in it. You would like, you would like roads. Yeah. It says this place called Old Town. We have dinner. Look how pretty the restaurant is. It's Alana. 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 Very nice. I'm going to have. Laura said she's got in a good spot because you can't push your wrist this way. That. I want Laura. Sorry, Laura. Laura. You have got very bendy wrists. <laughs> it's also got a thing that you might put in. thank you. Kind of. Well, sometimes they have like so much water. Yeah, sometimes they're in the first place. I think it's more like liquid. One honey fillet with fried potatoes and the grill is very good. Thank you. It's for you. Yummy. This is where we are sitting. Oh, are we are blurring. There we go. Look how pretty it is. They're shutting up shop around us though, but I think this turns into a bar. I'm hoping. Anyway, otherwise we're going to have to move. Oh, it won't be up. I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> I'm having a sex on the beach and apparently the rule is every time we have a cocktail we have to have a different one so rock and bubble yep we have to go to the lid that's another thing we love making it out this is a lid cool so I'll let you know how that goes will you please you got me please what is we just got a plate of carrots and if it's the same <laughs> Happy Sunday morning! Oh, I feel so much pressure! Our oh, uh, girls! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> also, Harry didn't go the distance. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. I hadn't filmed this morning and then they started doing the Macarena so I thought I'd better say hello. We are by the pool again today and then going home this evening. Are you allowed to be in this? <laughs> in your hat. <laughs> Never mind. We are, we've left the villa, but we are on our way to a really nice restaurant and we're going to have some dinner and then we're going to go straight to <laughs> the airport. Shining we all had fun. We had a great time. Yay! I look at the baby sun. The sun was like a You look like a what? Like a tiny top you saw. I don't like this angle. This is a great angle for you. What about this one? No. This one. The one when I'm not in it. <laughs> so mean. In this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Our restaurant is a car view. Yeah. But it's red. I don't know. Pretty good, eh? Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. We're going to have yeah, that's what mm, I'm pasta, I think. Yeah. What are you having? Pasta. Yeah. 
<laughs> something for to fill us up for our flight home because we've got a night flight. We fly at five to five to eleven. Land at like one. Get home at like three. So I need to fill my up. So pretty. Oh, this looks good. Oh, sorry. I know, right? Look at this. I put the end onto this vlog on the computer I thought I would just come and finish it off basically because last night I was so tired we got in at 4 30 in the end and by the time we got off the plane and got our baggage and got in the taxi which was late um actually funny story I rung our taxi and he was like oh you just caught me napping I was like right well can you stop and get to us because we've been on the go for like almost 12 hours and we would like to go home um, we ended up getting home at about half four in the end. Oh, I was so tired. So yeah, I was just done with vlogging. So I thought I would finish off now um, because I literally got into the house and fell into my bed. Um, it's been a very slow morning. I have answered some emails. I have caught up on Love Island. I've sent out some invoices and booked people in for some dates. And that's it. That's all I've managed to do. Um, I couldn't function any more than that <laughs> but um I'm so pleased with the way the weekend went it was the nicest weekend those girls are just well they're just my best friends really in the whole wide world and they're people most of them are people that I have known um since we were babies since we were born our mums and dads were friends before we were born um so we have grown up together we're just such a tight-knit group and I feel so completely comfortable with them you know that group of people that you just can totally be yourself with and they just love you for who you are and this is getting really slushy now if they're watching this they're gonna be like god's so but it's so true I love them to pieces um and I'm so glad that Hannah had an amazing weekend because that was my priority so that's basically what I was most anxious about really um my biggest worry was that the villa was going to not be what I thought it 
was going to be. I booked it on Airbnb. Um, it was called Asteri Villas. If anyone is looking for somewhere for a big group to go um, somewhere in Europe, I would highly recommend it. The owner is just so sweet. Um, they let us have the Sunday. So yesterday we were supposed to go to a beach club in the afternoon, um, in yeah, sort of lunchtime afternoon-ish, because we were supposed to check out by um, between 11 and 12. But they let us have the pool and use all the facilities for free for an extra day, which was so, so kind of them. They were so helpful. Um, so I would highly recommend it. And I was, yeah, I was concerned that it was gonna be like, you know when you see the photos online and they're beautiful and then you turn up and it's squalor and like the pool hasn't been cleaned in a year and no one's touched the the villa and no one's been there and it, but it wasn't obviously it was lovely other than a couple of um hitches with the taxi company at this end which were awful um the whole thing went very smoothly um and there were no real hitches so i'm really really pleased because i was quite anxious about it um i'm relieved it's over because i was anxious but I'm sad because it was just the nicest weekend and I wish we could have gone for a week. We keep saying we need to have a girls holiday so hopefully we can book that in soon. Yeah, so now six weeks to the wedding. And Hannah said to me, can you vlog my wedding like you vlogged yours? Because she wants to have it to look back on so I will do that for her. So you will see all the wedding um, and everything which is good because you've seen all the run up to it, all the dress fittings and all the excitement. Um, I think I filmed when they got engaged as well, so it's gone right from the beginning. Thank you very much for watching this week. Um, please like and subscribe. Oh, I know another thing I was going to say. Keep swapping arms, this makes my hands hurt. Another thing I was going to say is I don't know whether to do like a how to plan a Hindu party or a how to plan a Hindu blog. Um, it's really, really off-brand for me, but I feel like I've learnt so much and there's so much advice I could give to anybody who is trying to plan a Hindu and needs some help. Um, because, yeah, I feel like I've learnt a lot and I kind of know now the things that need to be done, things that you need to think about and things that you might not think about and we got there and we were like, oh, we should, should really have arranged that. Um, so if you would like that post, please do let me know and I will get it written up and published at some point. But I'm kind of in two minds because it's not really on brand for me, but I know it would be useful. So yeah, let me know in the comments down below if that's something that you would like to read um, and I will get it done. Other than that, please press the thumbs up button down below if you thought this was a fun vlog because we enjoyed it, so I hope you did too. Um, comment, subscribe, all the usual lovely stuff and I will see you again next week. Have a really great week. Bye.